Joined now by Liam Crone, part of the Mungret manager team. Liam, final last year for this group of players. The obvious step, hopefully, from your point of view, is winning the competition this year. Yeah, look, I suppose final last year, I, I suppose, uh, was last year, you know, and look, I suppose it's well publicised how competitive this competition is. Uh, we have a long way to get back to where we were last year and starts uh, Friday night against Maroubohar, like, you know, and I suppose, look, with the group that we're in, all three teams have played senior in, in the recent past, like, so we'll take it game by game and, and, and see where that takes us. Maroubohar, as you mentioned, a very experienced team at this level and higher level. It's a very difficult task up first. Yeah, and it's probably a bit similar to last year in the sense that we ended up drawing Kildime on the first game last year and a uh, really, really good game out in Clarina the same evening and I'm expecting the same on, on, on Friday in Clahan. I suppose with the way the seeded teams draw each other in the first round, it, it makes for an exciting opening round, that's for sure. You know, you mentioned that last couple of years, last year, finals-wise for Munger as a club, wasn't exactly what you would have been looking for obviously what what is the difference from making that next step up yeah look i suppose the, yeah it is uh, and look i suppose a lot of the players are a year older now like i mean there's no doubt that i suppose the age profile of our team is quite young uh, but even even having said that, I, I think the big difference for us is that a number of the younger players even yet again have come up from the likes of under-17 and 19 teams. Uh, and look, I, I suppose while we didn't win any finals last year, the fact that the minors were, were in a county final as well, it just means that there is that conveyor belt of talent coming through. There's a huge amount of work being done at, in, at, at, at club level and look, you're just hoping that if you can eventually keep knocking at the door, eventually you'll, you'll walk through it. You mentioned how competitive the competition is as a whole. A lot of people say it's the best competition within Limerick GA. How much do you get to enjoy that watching these type of games? Yeah, look, it's, it's extremely competitive and uh, I think I suppose from maybe not necessarily enjoy it too much while you're on the sidelines, but certainly from, 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 from an entertainment point of view, because you just don't know literally how one game is going to go. Like, I mean, there'd be nothing worse than a competition that's completely one-sided, like, you know, and I think the other thing about this competition is that any team that has gone up has shown that, they've can, that they can compete at Senior B level, like, you know, so I suppose between the six teams of Senior B and the eight teams in the Premier Intermediate, there's, there's 14 teams there with very, very little between them.